No. And this is for the game. Oh no. Oh, I made that. Oh, oh hell no, this game trash. This game is garbage, bro. Yo, yo, clip that. This game is trash. Hey guys, it's LJ. Make sure you like the video and subscribe for more great content from my daddy. Good morning, that damn 2K man, man. Check this out, man. So it all started with a tweet from my boy, yo boy. My twin, hey man, that's my guy right there, man, TJ. He just says, hey man, can y'all at least take the view bots off when you're running the rerun so y'all don't have to, so y'all don't mess up the top spots in the 2K category? This stuff is so wild. 80% of the 2K community is sleeping right now now and i mean you know, i'm not gonna lie to y'all man this is something that's true but let me tell you something t jizzle man I'm, I'm gonna be honest with your stats uh they they can't they can't take them off because uh the reason that they're running reruns is because they're view body so the way that it works the way at least the way that it was explained to me is that as long you if you buy the view bots and you put them on there the view bots will stay there as long as the stream is active so they load up the the uh joint after the stream so they don't have to keep paying for the view bots over and over so instead of because if they did it that way they would have to pay for the view bots every time they did it so what they do is they buy the view bots one time and they leave the stream going as long as humanly possible so that they can so that they can get the maximumness from the view botness and the reason that uh and the, the way that you know that is because when the stream dies or like let's say the internet acts up or something like that it'll go from like a thousand and then you'll see two 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 people in there watching or something like that then the next day you know it'll go through the roof when they come back on oh my bad guys i didn't know that the stream had a block up on the screen and you couldn't even see the gameplay uh, but it was a thousand people in here but when the internet died all of a sudden some kind of how it went down to two people but don't worry i took the block off the screen now we're back to a thousand that we like come on man hey man like, listen man if you think people are not viewed by the name something up with this stuff, shut the f up shut the f up bro i'm not gonna lie to y'all this that's why it's, this is the reason why it's so hard for a lot of the streamers new streamers to get in because we know how a lot of new streamers used to get in. You had to get on at like three o'clock in the morning, five o'clock in the morning, and you could build yourself a fan base because nobody was on at that time. Now, it's really no longer possible because the view bots are there and people are uh, taking advantage of a loophole in the system. And, uh, the, uh, you know, the crazy thing is I can't even get mad because I was one of the original people doing reruns back in 2008, 2009. But um, view bots didn't exist back then. The only reason I did was because I wanted people to, like people would say, hey man, I miss your stream, I'm, I'm overseas, can you run something so I can see what happened the day before? I was like, all right, cool. And then, but you know, I stopped after a while because it just was like, like, I mean, number one, back then it wasn't no money in it at all. But now that there's so much money in it, man, it's gonna, it's corrupted, it's perverted, it's, it just is what it is. But hey man, them guys gonna do what they do. Um, I ain't, I'm not with it. But hey, I'm, I'm gonna let them feed their families and do what they gotta do. It just sucks that if you're a new person trying to get in, or even me trying to break back in, right? It's tough because like you you gotta battle somebody that's not even there, that's there 24 hours a day. Now you could do the same thing, but like I don't know, man. It just is what it is. But y'all let me know what y'all think about that, man. But you see those channels is dying slowly anyway. Um, you know, the people doing straight reruns, that that's dying slowly, but the ones that view by with reruns, they're going strong, man. And I'm guessing that that with Twitch and all of that, you must still get paid a hefty sum depending on how many people are in there because they're doing it. They wouldn't be doing it and running reruns if it wasn't. But anyway, man, let's, let's talk about something else, man, because that's I can talk about that stuff all day, and we know they're doing it. We know who's doing it, and it ain't no denying it. And if you say something about it, they're going to be hating, and they're going to say that you're hating, and I'll just be like, hey, man, come on, man. Shut the f*** up. Shut the f*** up, bro. You think everybody's stupid, but you, like, we know what you're doing, bro. We know who's doing it, and we know how to tell if you're doing it. And there's sites that you can go on and literally tell you that these are fake people watching the stream. But I ain't gonna do none of that. I digress, man. Anyway, let's get right into the video, man, because Mike Wong made some changes on the game and all of that stuff, man. I'm not a fan of it, but I can play it. I can deal with it. We've adapted. It is what it is. I think we only lost, like, two games this weekend or whatever. And, uh, you know, it, it's... And it, none of it was due to the patch, man. It was just people not playing defense, man. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment y'all thoughts down below. Y'all know we're trying to go with this thing. To the moon, Alice! And if nobody told y'all this today, y'all, my brothers, my sisters, my family, love each and every last one of y'all, man. That boy Joseph knows. So we're going to start off with him. And he just says, man, I think I might have found one for the Pro-Am, man. And y'all already see it right here, man. It is it is the LeBron. Come on, man. You know he got the LeBron bill, man. The King Joseph A two-way slashing shot creator you know what the crazy part is 
that's the original one of the original bills that our man man grind man man grind the fuck hard and brutal sim used to use man the two-way slash i think man man used the two-way slash and shot creator and then brute used the two the uh shot creating slasher back in 2k18 that, that bill right there was a beast not gonna lie and i don't know if that's jay yoda don or whatever but jay yoda don used to have one of them too man that was tough man he said bro you get everything 99 i don't want to hear it <laughs> say, oh, say no hey it is what it is man but like i said hey hey it's about damn time man that's what it is right there man but look though he say hey i don't know what the build is i'm not gonna put it out there you gotta go over there and watch your video on that but now to the main course the main ph to resist on the main thing that we talking about today man that boy mike wongman tweeting i say that boy mike wongman tweeting <laughs> we've all noticed that uh you can't get a shot contest to save your soul even if you're standing on top of somebody's feet and people are shooting the ball and uh we had already deduced that if you don't jump nothing happens and most of the time when you jump nothing still happens as we're gonna see in a second man but hey check this out that boy mike Wong said this the contest logic for season two is pretty different uh from season one the key is to have your hand as close to the ball uh, as possible as it leaves the shooter's hand. If you're on top of the shooter when the when he starts the shot uh, with using right stick hands up, it's usually enough. But generally, you're going to want to jump at every shot to get the best contest, especially if there's any gap between you and the shooter. Not the best contest, any type of contest at all and he's and somebody this was somebody this was in response to this right here mike uh, he said hey can you explain the contest this how the contest system work i'm putting hands uh i'm putting hands down people's throats on the perimeter and they still and they get open uh contest uh my hands up in the paint with 74 interior and i'm getting laid over by guards point guards and stuff like that man listen man i think that this was a terrible uh type of play call not a good design or anything like that and let me tell you why because playing basketball um you we told it just you don't leave your feet like to play defense unless unless you have to but like that's the absolute last resort leaving your feet jumping at something or what have you want to try to play defense with good position and be there hands up up jump a little bit maybe but the last thing we wanted to do was leave is, is leave your feet under most circumstances is what i'm saying now we're not talking about y'all that, that play ball at la fitness y'all jump at everything jumping into the person's body and then fall on the dude and then that's still not a foul shoot for it. like i'm not even arguing with y'all i just take my bag and go home with this stuff man but it's just crazy to me that this is what they did they made defense more difficult and then they buffed open shots so you made defense harder, but then after you made defense harder, you made shooting easier, made defense harder, and then you made contested shots easier to hit, but harder to contest a shot. That is absolutely insane to me. Like I don't, I, I don't get how that made sense. So they don't, they just don't want defense in the game at all. Is what I'm saying because like it's harder to get a contest yet. The contested shots got buffed. I don't get it. But, hey, it is what it is, man. It must be that vision for the game right there. And, hey, like I said, I can shoot those right there. It says wide open, even though I feel like that guy was there right there. But, hey, it is what it is. That boy grinding says, hey, man, please look into the uh, into the drop step animation. I have 99 strength on on uh, 99 strength center teammates getting back down and drop step on uh, every play. Now, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I have not seen that. Uh, we got Wavy and Gambit, but we've been in the wreck too, so I've not seen that. I've not really experienced that. I'm not saying that that's not happening, but I will tell you that there's a market improvement in, in uh, interior defense. I'm getting a lot of blocks now. I'm, I'm stopping people at the basket, and I got like 674 interior and stuff like that. My guy's a lot more active and stuff, so it feels like it's better, but a lot of people saying it's not better, man, so we'll see how that goes, man. Up next, hey, hey, we're just going to look at some of the responses. Dude says, in my, in my opinion, in order to balance this, you should tone down fouls when jumping at the shooter or 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 else there's no benefit to jumping that's absolutely right man how you gonna tell me i gotta jump every time but every time i jump i'm getting a foul and there's no way for me to say i want to go right or left or jump around the guy i'm gonna tell y'all what i did man y'all putting um y'all putting y'all putting the up and down on the paddles on my joints right here bro i put um i put um the jump button right here 
because I'm like I gotta be able to I gotta be able to jump faster and uh and all of this stuff. So that's what I did with that. But we'll see how that goes. Hey man, he says chain shooting back even casuals is shooting like Curry now. There's no skill gap. You're absolutely right. Hey dude, see this is where we always got somebody talking about some play better defense, bro. He just literally told us that we can't play any better defense. And he said play better defense. LOL before the patch, that was your excuse. They shouldn't um they shouldn't change the game for casuals who can't learn their shot no skill gap i mean it's gonna be a skill gap either way because like i said we winning games but hey it, it is what it is he says you're basically just allowing garbage to go in i'm not jumping I, yeah i'm not jumping at everything i want to play hands up defense when need be fix the defense to uh to stop lady bombs paint mash high interior bills i'm not gonna lie to that bro like i, I get what you're saying but bro you're gonna tell this man he told you what you have to do and you're gonna tell him i'm not jumping hey then you're just gonna lose games bro you gotta do what they said jump so they get their own yeah jump so they can get their own miss exactly but even when you don't jump they're gonna get their own miss anyway man that's what i'm saying though. like like it's just like he says use the stick i'm not using the stick you're gonna change the game and it's like hey uh you gotta jump i'm not jumping i'm gonna play hands up you gotta play this game listen i do believe that they will eventually change the game but i just don't think that you can tell somebody what they what you're going to do in response to what they're telling you that you have to do it's just like it's like like if I, it's like i moved to britain great britain and then they say yeah you got to drive on the uh right side of the road left side of the road and i'm like i'm not driving over there y'all got to change the rule bro that's that's absolutely insane but Hey, keep losing games behind that, and you'll see what happens. Hey, jumping at every shot to get somewhat of a contest is not good, Mike. I agree with that. That's the way, that's the better way to sell. I don't feel like we already, you know, people are already going to hit you with stuff. This is what I feel like is going to end up happening eventually. People are going to understand that they can do that, and they're going to run, stop, and then they're going to go, and, like, we're just going to be dead. And the people are already starting to figure that out. I'm surprised that more people haven't figured it out yet, that you run, stop, get some space, and the dude has to jump because if he doesn't, you go, you know, then you wait for him to fly by, you turn and go back the other way. So I think that's I think that that's what's going to end up happening. It's going to be bad for everybody. The OG Grandmaster Sensei says, I don't know if you're trying to covert, say we got to jump at dudes on the perimeter if we're right in front of them, because if the, if so, that's crazy as heck and it's horrible for gameplay on so many levels. I agree with that. He says, literally, the jump mechanic on the perimeter defense has never been good, so that's why hands up has been a thing. And then this dude said, this is beyond the laws of logic. Uh, if I jump, I risk getting blown by, exactly, blown by 4-2. If, uh, if I jump in the paint, I risk getting dunked, <laughs> dunked on. It's too much risk. Uh, no reward on defense. I agree with that. I don't know who thought this was a good idea, but clearly they don't want you helping on this game. They don't want you playing zone. They don't. They want everybody playing man on man, and uh, they, that's what they really want because you can't help you. Like I said, you can't help. You can't stunt. You can't do nothing, and and that's that's all that can be done, man. And like I said, and then so uh, Hanky the Tanky says, "Hey, thanks for the explanation. Can we bluff buff interior defense?" Like I said, man. I feel like interior defense is in a good place, but I have not gone against anybody that was just straight mashing yet. So y'all let me know if y'all gone to anybody that was straight mashing yet because I haven't just yet. But uh, if that's a still a thing, y'all let me know. Hey, that boy Don Work says, man, hey, every time a PG go 4 for 15 in the wreck, uh, this is my favorite thing. I dropped 40 last game. I mean, hold on, let me say. I dropped 40 last game using the same shot. Dude talking about I'm about to spin. I'm about to speed my jumper up. I told that dude it's time to speed those passes up. I ain't lying to you, but that's what they need to be doing, man. Sometimes you're you're just not, it just ain't clicking, my dog. It just ain't clicking, man. He says, uh, tell us, so you telling us that you want us to jump at every single shot is literally the most brain dead basketball statement I have ever heard. I agree with that. I mean, I can't lie. We gotta call the spade a spade or uh, uh, ace a ace or uh, whatever it is, man. The ace of base. You got to you got to call it that, man, because because um it's, it's just not that's not good basketball it's just not you don't want to leave your feet especially on the perimeter and never file a jump shooter like these are basic rules of basketball because uh, you don't want to leave your feet on the perimeter because you never want to file a jump shooter let's just say it like that hey this man says say how do you get we say how do you get it from that man if you're playing good defense and put your hands up that's enough but if there's a gap then jump at the shooter uh, but you know, it's not if it's a gap. Sometimes you're standing right on top of the dude's feet. It's just not working at all, man. Honest opinion, is the game play better or, or better or worse after the patch? I said it's worse, but hey, it's just because I don't 
Like, I mean, it's all, listen, it's already hard enough to defend people prior to the patch. Now that now I have to jump at them, so I gotta be within distance to jump. Like I said, we're adapting, we're being able to play, but man, it just makes the game so much more difficult. I think people are going to realize pretty soon that you cannot play defense in this motherfucker. And then like, we're gonna be just at the mercy of those guys. Speaking of which, man, let me show y'all this shirt real quick. Hey man, this joint tough right here. This is the, this is the Deadpool, um, uh, this is my, this is one we made, Deadpool, uh, uh, you know, fall shirt, man. It's gonna be in the store today. If y'all wanna pick one up, I'ma put it in that special price, $9.99 right now. So go ahead and check that out, man. Back to the game, shameless plug. Breeze Tees, get your tees in the breeze. When you're rocking with Breeze Tees, link down in the description. Holler at your boy. And we sell DTF transfers if you do your own t-shirt business. So check that out. That boy A. Carter says, hey, lanes need to be, need to be upped a bit again. Nah, they don't. They lead the lanes, whether yet. I think that, the, I think that they were good pre-patch. That's a lie. Uh, besides the warp animations of Superman steals, but that was the problem. That was why they were good because of those. Like this is like saying, uh, I think it's a good day outside because I don't. Th I think it's hot. Uh, it's it's good just because it's hot. If the sun wasn't shining, then it'll be like, come on, bro. You can't. You that's that's why they were good is because of those unrealistic ones. So uh, that's that's just how it goes. But uh, I can literally throw it in people's faces now and they can't get it right because they have no reaction time. If they had reaction time, they would have been. And, and we're gonna talk about that in one second. Y'all went a little too far with the lanes, giving the pat, giving the patch time to marinate though i don't think they went uh exactly what dude said this is cap just be close enough to get the lane and time it right like that's that's really what it is hey you you was the main one complaining please shut up boy y'all boys be y'all boys be going in but let me tell y'all what i was saying about the uh what was he saying about the lane so he was just saying um you know the superman steals and all that stuff uh let me see let me see the free pass besides you can literally throw it at somebody's face uh and they can't get it actually you you can get it and say y'all win it but you know when 2k does something man they 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 it's 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 either on or off you can get the steals you can get the, you can do uh everything that you normally used to do uh, it's just not OD now. And it's just like what I was going to say. This is what I was going to say. It's weird because people be talking about they timing it right. You're doing this. You're doing that. How is it that y'all could time an action that I, I'm doing something. I'm throwing the basketball. So you have to proceed. You have to, I have to do it. Then you have to perceive that I'm doing it. Then you have to determine what the right reaction is and then do the appropriate reaction that y'all see that right there. Light pressure. And he still hit that. Check that out right there. Both of us right there. Both, both of us right there on, on it. Now, I know you can pick it apart and say that we weren't, but we were. It's the game said we were light pressure. But how is it? Explain this to me. How are y'all able to time steals so well, but you can't time that custody? That's what I want to know. How can you not time your jump shot? You can't react to differences in your jump shot, but every time a steal goes up or something like that, you're just timing it. That's not possible. You would be, if you had that, you that means you got superhuman reaction time, which means that you should be able to react to either thing. If you can react to the steals and get those so well, you should be able to react to the changes in your jump shot like this, and you would have been able to time that custom. That's why I call Cap on it, but hey, it is what it is. That girl, Boomy, says, hey, this is this game is so unbalanced toward the offense right now. Defense feels non-existent. Plucks are better, and that's depending on who you play with. You play with a one in the five nines, you're not getting one. But, uh, but we can't get good contests especially on phase. That's a fact. Uh, lanes are nerfed into the ground, rewarding low pass uh, low pass accuracy. I don't think it's rewarding low pass accuracy. I get a lot of them joints. I'm not going to lie. You just got to really, really time it. The offensive morph, morph back um, to every loose ball. That's true. Paint defense is abysmal. Don't agree there. I think it's better than it has been. I'm not saying it's the greatest yet, but I'm, I'm telling you, I'm getting way more stops in the paint with my interior. The arrow is our biggest op. It's just frustrating. That is a fact. I'll be in the left corner. So, uh, point guard be on the right hash. They'll have me on him, and then Brute can't get a contest, and the dude splashes. And I think that might be low-key the real issue uh, with the game, but input delay is way better, but but uh better which which to me well was the issue on offense buffing shooting without a significant buff uh to the contest hurts the game in my opinion i'm okay if i'm okay if i have to jump at certain shots that's true but but we can't be we can't reward the offense by allowing them to just throw up crazy crazy bailout passes when uh when we know that they don't have the badge i agree with that i agree with all of this stuff right there man it is what it is hey that boy uh that boy ipod king carter the hustlingest man in the 2k community says uh no not enough characters to explain but it's worse that's it right there hey, hey that boy post guy says zero skill gap in shooting zero skill gap passing iq uh you still can't just throw any passes i'm, I'm sorry buff the shooting buff 
buff the shooting causes low ratings to to benefit and turn and in turn ruin the balance uh balance builder nerf the passing nerf the passing lane causes low pass accuracy bills again i mean bills again to ruin uh the balance the builder and then buff the shooting also kills the reason for rhythm shooting they just broke rhythm shooting me and yard mine and the guys was playing yesterday and we agreed that the yeah, rhythm shooting is just in the dirt right now but everywhere else is cool but in the wreck that was a crazy delay uh but then me and gambit gambit did say hey man i, I ain't have a real issue so i think if you got dribble moves on because people was complaining about it, it was too responsive and they were rhythm shooting they were just trying to do moves and we call cap on that all of us did but um but yeah if you turn off dribble moves on the stick and it's just shooting then you'll get uh instant shots with that uh pause you know hey the, uh what's the name that boy nike said the patch had me debating do i want to play the tourney or go to dallas for this fair i agree with that and he says i'm losing the dudes who i never lost to 48 hours ago and that that right there is the biggest thing we're gonna look at this from ipod king carter man and he's just gonna tell y'all what he thinks after the pass go ahead ipod three seconds two seconds he's not even paying attention all right i'm, I'm down for one hey, look look he's not even paying attention Money. I already know. Money Slap money. me in my face if you want to, nigga. It was open every single time. Slap me, punch me, elbow me, kick me. It don't matter. It's open, nigga. <laughs> and that's how I feel about it, man. And I ain't mad at him because I'm shooting everything. Y'all seen me hit the hit one of them joints, man. That boy Garcia says, "Hey, Mike, can you explain why certain times we don't put a hand up? Uh, we don't put a we don't have to put a hand up or the right stick." Uh, I can speak. I can speak for so many times. It doesn't register on offense. But then he came back with this, and he's talking about the new contest logic, and he's showing you how that that's that. This is pretty much with the new contest logic. You're running down there. He's running down court, and he doesn't get a hand up. And he wasn't there when the shot went up. Challenger registered, and, uh, and he got some type of contest. I don't know what the contest was though. But look, yeah, no hands up. Still got a contest. And he wasn't there when the dude, you know, he's nowhere near the ball hand or any of that. I just don't know what the contest was. So I guess he has that turned off, but you can't really see what the contest was, man. But hey, hey he's right, though. You can still get those. That's how we used to play defense in the beginning, uh, you know, just with the drive-bys and stuff like that, man. But hey, uh, it just it just is what it is, man. Hey, we go right back to where we are. What where this one dude says, Evan, can you explain? How, oh, this is how you talking about how the contest system works, and then we're gonna end it where we started with my boy TJ saying, LMAO, uh, you can't even take this stuff seriously no more. On God for y'all, uh, for y'all in the comments about the uh, shot contest, and this is what he's showing you right here. He's there. He's on top of the foot. There is no gap. And he still hit the shot, man. And it's like you get light pressure. Now, we're not saying that you can't hit any of those, but it's so hard to get a light pressure that I don't we want to see none of them go in. But he's right there. I don't know what better defense he can play except for the jump, man. And, and it is what it is. And last but not least, we got that boy EJ telling y'all how he feel about the game. Talk to him, EJ. No. And this is for the game. Oh, no. Oh. I made oh that? Oh, hell oh no, nah, this God. game trash. This game is garbage, bro. Yo, yo, clip that. This game is trash. The contest system is garbage. Yeah, this game trash. This game trash. This game trash. This game trash, this game trash bro. Ain't no way I made that. Look at this right there. He said, ain't no way I made that shot. Dude, right there in his face. There is no gap. There is no space. But he didn't jump. He's right there. And he did jump. But the ball is already gone by the time he jumped. Like I said, you gotta be, you gotta have some time to react. He's there. He did jump, whatever. Oh, no. In 2K, oh. maybe that is a jump. I made that. I don't no know. way I made that. And he don't, and he's saying there's no way, way. I, made I made that, man. So like I said, bro, it is what it is, bro. A lot of people, you know, they're gonna have their opinion about the game. Have your opinion, but I can tell you that right now, I don't like the state of the game. And at a high level, this is gonna be really crazy to, uh, to see how that goes but let me know what you guys think down in the comment section do y'all like where the game is do y'all like where it's going do y'all like jumping at every well, shot do y'all like it when it do y'all like it when it happens uh to y'all but not when it happens against you i don't know man let me know what y'all think down in the comment section man hopefully y'all enjoyed the video and i will holler at y'all next time till next time hit that like button subscribe if you're new it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's town Gosh, baby. Gosh, baby.